And we're rolling. Hello, and welcome to Pokemon TCG Daily, match number eight. Fellow trainers, I hope you're having a fantastic night wherever you are. It has been a fun 24 hours for me. Uh, I just got done playing at one week uh, uh, cup today in preparation just to get a little bit of extra in-person practice today. Uh, my matches went very, very well. I went two wins, uh, two losses, and one uh, one draw. Um, all the matches, none of the matches were shut out. I did very, very well in every single one of them. Uh, those losses, there was just um, a couple parts where I had burnt, uh, burnt out just a little bit, overthought a couple things. Um, you know, it's one of those things that's uh, funny. I'll, I'll go ahead and hop into the match in just a second. I was just making a couple edits to my deck, but I don't think I'm going to finalize anything quite yet. I want to play with what I have played with today. Um, and it's one of those things that... You know, I can go ahead and do probably like a ton of online matches, like e even right now. Um, but you know, it's so much more. At least my experience, it, it might differ from person to person. My uh, the in-person experiences, at least for me, that it takes a lot. You know, you you're at a place, you're engaged, and you know, it takes a lot more uh, mental capacity. It, it was a long, it was a very, it was a pretty long day. We usually at the local one in the town I'm at, we have a pretty good turnout. So everyone got to play in the Masters Division. Got to play five matches so you know you figure 25 minutes a piece it was uh, well over three hours um i mean regionals next next saturday uh it can well potentially be a uh, 12 hour day so um good things good things are coming though right now so i'm deciding if i want to make any changes to this deck and like and like i said earlier is uh all those losses earlier they were just usually just because honestly i just made mistakes in them it, it happens especially when um you know you just get tired you get frazzled in person but you know the best players learn how to work through that um but i'm glad i went today i have one more going on tomorrow uh, a, a friend of mine there who's will be traveling with me and this will be the first one it's uh, a couple towns over um, but he told me that this comic book store, it's actually like a pretty decent size and that potentially up to like 40 people participate at this one. And I had, I had no idea, idea. So I'm excited to check that out. It's almost like a mini like regionals in a sense. So that's on the horizon for tomorrow. And then I want to do, uh, I probably will do a compilation video of, um, of the entire weekend. Uh, we'll see just kind of how things, uh, go from and go from there. Uh, this deck right now that I'm playing against reminds me a little bit of one of my uh, my buddy I played against earlier today who was rocking a uh, Glaceon GX and alone uh, Volpix. It's a very fantastic deck. This person is working a Zorua uh, variation of a sword, so either he'll probably use the GX um, the GX Pokemon and maybe a um, uh, the regular Alolan Nine Tails as well, which the Alolan Nine Tails ability is prevents all damage and uh, affects and abilities from EX and GX Pokemon. Um, it's one of those things right now. I just can't decide if I want to change anything in my deck this late in my season, right before I'm about to go play regionals. There's a couple edits I want to make, but you know, as I was thinking, none of the matches I lost were they, they were just because I made I made really stupid mistakes. I could have turned a couple of those losses around into wins. Um, like I said, I, I you know, I, I literally, I do not mind if I ever lose matches because very rarely these days, at least. I mean, it does happen. You saw that alone. Uh, those of you who watched that alone duck trio video, I got I got the uh, floor mopped of me yesterday. I honestly don't care that I lose. I just I just love playing every single match and just try to, you know, it sucks. Every, you know, no one wants to, no one wants to lose. But every single match, you learn just a little bit more about your deck and how you can do better next time. And that's kind of that's kind of all you can do. Um, right here, for example, right now, I'm hoping uh, there's a couple options I have. I want to get that Alolan Vulpix out, so this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to try to bring him out. He's gearing him up. And what I hope to get, I don't know if this is going to happen, I'm going to go ahead and bring him out. There's not much else I can do at this moment. I'm gonna go ahead and play Devour Field as well. And I wanna attach that double colors energy. I'm gonna attach it to Zorua. I have a lot of Zorworks in my deck and hope I can get the knockout and we'll see what happens. Zorg, Zorg, Ultra Ball, Zorg, Ultra Ball, yes, Zorg, uh, perfect, perfect timing. Oh, like I said, I love this deck so much. It brings me a uh, great joy to be working on a deck like this. 20, 40, 60, 80 for the knockout, slow down my opponent just a little bit more. Um, I don't, I, I always debate if I'm going to use puzzle time. It's a little early in the match to see where things are going to go. I don't want to trade anything out of my hand. I could trade, uh, actually, 
I can trade a Bridget. Yeah. Okay. Let's go just a little, a little bit deeper into that deck. Perfect. Glad I didn't use that puzzle all time. That's cool. 90 for the knockout. You know, I will be, I, I, I think already with even doing a week course of these, you know, I really am just about ready to do a live stream. I've, I've known even for the first of these uh, daily matches that I've done, I've already become a lot more well-spoken. Awesome draw with that ultra patch on their part. Um, Alolan, Alolan Ninetales GX, fantastic card. Um, you know, I'm in a good spot right now. I got guys uh, geared up, and they're going to play Alolan. Alolan Ninetales, all right. 50 damage to one of my Pokemon, or 160. And Ice Path GX is a similar uh, attack from a, a, a Mewtwo card. That way it wasn't a GX attack. I'm actually a little surprised if this um, is a GX attack. So, let's see. What I want to do. I'm surprised I have not played like Tapu Lele or anything yet. They're gonna go in for. I'd be really surprised. Oh, ooh. Interesting. And we see you can play this card only if your active Pokemon your opponent chooses two bench and shuffle all others and cards attached to them. Um, hmm. Interesting. I could do. Hold on one second, what do I have in my discard pile? Cynthia. Hear me out here for a second. I think I'm gonna throw, cause I, but he's already geared up, so uh, I might regret this, but I'm gonna put those. Wait, what? Wait a second, did you guys see that? Your opponent chooses Two bench Pokemon? That that must have been... That was weird. I, I don't think it was supposed to do that. I think that was a glitch. Hold on. I don't, I don't think I read that. Uh, I'm... I kind of feel sorry, because I think... Two bench Pokemon. The only, you can only play this card if your active Pokemon is a water assume. Your opponent chooses two bench Pokemon and shuffles the others and all cards attached them into their deck. Yeah, that, um... Oh, okay, now I understand what it said. I get to choose which two Pokemon I keep, and then all the other ones go to my deck. Interesting. Okay, cool. I was a little uh, confused about that card. Um, that's fine, actually, too. That's fine. I'm gonna go ahead and try to just dig a little deeper into this deck. <laughs> uh, let's see. I'm actually gonna probably hold on to... Um, and I got plenty of ends. I don't want to play in right now, anyways. Hmm. Let's kind of get Rock Ruff powered up. And those other cards are in there still. 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 100, 110. Yeah, that's a respectable number. Yep. Let's do that. No, I thought that this discarded uh, two of my Pokemon, but I get to choose two Pokemon, so that's what this card is. I'm actually very uh, new to a lot of the proof. I haven't actually, this would be the first time I've seen one of the star cards used in action, actually. I haven't, um, no, I have not seen this card used yet in, in a match. I think I gotta play maybe ready. They're gonna discard both of my... They're gonna attack with, um, I think they're gonna attack for 160 and discard their double colorless energy. I think I might have an idea. I need my Lycan Rock and I need a double color. That'll work too. So I want to get my uh, Lycan Rock right now that I plan to knock out that nine tail. Uh, this actually is perfect because I need um, just a little bit more damage right now. 
I'm gonna go ahead and attach this fighting energy here because 50, 100, 150, 200, dangerous rope, GX. I, I still need to find, um, yeah, I still need to get a uh, lightning rock. So we're gonna do that right now. I can do something kind of cool here. I am gonna start Guzma and describe this energy card. We're gonna go ahead and grab lightning rock right now. which will give me just enough with that strong energy there to get the knockout. I will not retreat right now. And I'm gonna retreat him out. And I think I'm gonna do something. I'm gonna try to get, uh, I have enough, um, I'm gonna try to ace or roll him back into safety right now. And I think I just have enough to do that because I haven't played a supporter card yet. So I need this Ultra Ball and I'm gonna be discarding something back into there, so let's go ahead, I'll go ahead and discard Bridget. Bridget is just gonna go straight back in there, and they gave me the victory. Ah, oh, I wanted to, no, I wanted to keep going with that match. Ah, oh. well, okay, I don't know if I'll be saving this video. That was gonna be a cool, the, so the turnaround there was gonna be, I was gonna Ultra Ball, go for Tapu Lele, grab the G, actually I'll go I'll go through the thought process a little bit, because maybe I'll just have this be today's video. I was gonna go for Tapu Lele, because I couldn't even remember if Tapu Lele was in there, and then with Tapu Lele, I was gonna go for Acerola and just uh, heal up uh, Zor uh, Zork GX while I had the chance, I hadn't played a supporter card yet. I was gonna knock out my opponent with Dangerous Rogue GX, but because I didn't know how the uh, match was gonna, the opponent had plenty of strategies still to um, finish that match. I, I try not, I try not to do that as much anymore, like when, um, uh, if I have a way to like, you know, uh, end, th end things, you know, if, if it gets close to the match, even in-person matches, if I know that I absolutely, there's no way I can win, um, or it would, it would be a miracle, I know all my uh, tools and stuff are my discard pile, but that was a, that was an entertaining match, a little short, maybe we can do, maybe I can do one more with this video, or this might be the cutoff point, um, let's go ahead and try to do one more. That was going to be a good match. I, uh, I hope to work up to that computer search. I would love to work all the way up to N. I don't know if that's going to be possible. Computer search will happen. Thankfully, um, this is uh, my finals week right now, so then I need to just get through these next couple days, and then after that, it's going to be Pokemon, Pokemon, Pokemon uh, for uh, the next like well, week or so. so. Let's see if we can get one more match, and I, that one wasn't too long. But yeah, that is an interesting um, comparison. I mean, even thinking right now, um, uh, you know, I'm just clicking things on my computer. You know, this is the exact same deck that I used earlier today. But just right now, I'm a, I'm not anywhere near as like as like exhausted as I was like doing the person event. Cause like right now, I'm in the comfort of my own home with my laptop, with my dog, with a cup of coffee right beside me. I can literally kick my legs up on on my chair or something, lean back, and you know, I can still be. It's it, this, you know, at home it really is. Uh, I treat these matches as like real life scenarios, but it still is a more relaxed environment. Um, so which is why I'm glad I'm getting one more chance to go play at a league tomorrow. And as I mentioned, tomorrow's actually is a, at a pretty cool, pretty cool location. So that was my first time playing at this new place. I was happy that two were going on this uh, Phantom. Interesting. I have not seen a Phantom in a while. There we go. Now here's an, here's an interesting matchup. Okay, I'm gonna bridge it. In. Let's go ahead, Zorua. Uh, one of my matches earlier today, Mewtwo, I was happy with, uh, you know, I, I think I am just gonna leave everything the way it is right now. I'm just, I'm just happy. I, I have every card in here memorized right now. And, and you know how it is, even just changing like one thing dynamically can like, change the entire way how your your deck flows so i think this is going to be the way i play with regionals i was thinking of throwing in one more cynthia throwing in one more mel throwing in one more float stone actually you know if i were to do something right now it would be to put in one more float stone uh i just like everything the way it is right now so i know what their strategy is i think as um what is it the tree guy i should know his evolution is uh i think his pokemon because the other, the one from the X Y era rotated out, so he's not in standard. I should know. I should know his name. I'm sad I don't know his name.
Yep. I, did, I was happy this deck did very good uh, against Trubbish and Garbodor. Um, all, all, all that stuff today, it, it held up really well. I got my Leaf Blowers when I needed them. Uh, looks like he is going straight in for the uh, this this Garbodor, but I'll see to be TBA if he has the other one, if he's going to play it. Uh, what I do love about this deck right now is that, um, you know, uh, Garbodor, something I didn't even realize until I was playing against it earlier today, neither one of them, if I can get them, um, if I can get them out on the bench, then I don't really have too much to worry about. I can usually knock them out, like, you know, the person he'll probably retreat out for is Tapu Lele is what I would do just to take the damage. Uh, he will retreat him out because I can knock him out pretty easily with any of my guys. Um... Ascension. Here we go. This is an interesting match. Talking 120. I think I don't know if I will be able to knock it out yet. Um, the opponent. Uh, interesting, interesting, interesting hybrid. I love when people combine old cards and new cards together. Your opponent reveals their hand. This is 30 damage for each trainer card you have in your hand. I'm gonna get rid of every trainer card I have in my hand this turn. Uh. So I think I know what I'm going to do. I can't evolve. I just need to get... Kind of risky, but I'm just going to keep going ahead and... Uh, trying to just evolve as many people as I can. <laughs> they got a fun deck. <sighs> I can't believe I have to play... Uh, I have to play and, and give them more stuff in their hand. I can't use my abilities. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. Let's see what this does. Cool. That's cool. At least that's that stalls at the very least. So, and I guess I will play. I could play Remoraid. No, I'll wait. Um, oh, I'm playing him. Alrighty. Let's see. So neither one of these attacks is uh, there. They have a cool deck. This is a cool hybrid. Like I said, Trev, uh, Trevin, uh, Trevenant. That's um, I should remember that there was the he's gotten a couple ones. There was one. I think he had another one that was um, that prevented. Was there? He's had two psychic types. He had one from the XY. Uh, I think it was the base set that was very popular for a while. Um, and then he also had. Um, uh, one from I, I don't remember actually I don't remember what the second one was from but that prevented like it made your Pokemon's retreat cost higher I think that was his other one and he's getting more of those guys ready the I mean the one thing I have like you know it's it's one of those things right now that I do have the like in my advantage of you know Gar Garbador you got to think you know right now if he runs out of cards he can't use Instruct he can't use his Lele's um, I just don't have any item cards in my hand right now. It does do more damage, so hopefully I can get something retreat uh, Zorak out. None of these, the the, um, the variation, this is just a different uh, take on this um, right now. I don't need, uh, like I said, I just got to try to hope that I can get one of my, what was that one? choice and gonna have to uh i'm gonna go ahead and evolve lycan rod just because i can it sucks that i don't get the ability uh bonus right now but they have a they have a cool deck exactly what i needed a hundred percent what i needed they haven't set up really for much else yet I'm sure um, this actually kind of almost reminds me of mill deck I'm sure they also have other fun things in there we're gonna go field blower this and yeah especially while I have the chance to use my abilities I'm gonna take advantage full advantage of that moment we're gonna go ahead and lay lay 20 40 60 80 100 120 uh, I think I will Mallow because at the very least that um, he could play N or something and I'm uh, or attach another uh, Wait a second 
Yeah, I already attached an energy card, so I can't retreat. I would love to knock out that garb gar Garbador, but I don't think that's gonna happen quite yet. I'm gonna go ahead and still, actually, I'm gonna go for Guzma. Let's go for Guzma, because I do have another energy here right now. Let's do that. I will get the knockout here, because uh, it's going to take him just a little bit to set up. I could trade some more. I could do more of that, but 20, 40, 60, 80. Uh, oh, I need one more Pokemon. Let's see what we can do here. That is the last of my end, so that's a little bit scary, but that's okay. I got a Mewtwo. That's exactly what I needed. Just one more Pokemon just to get a little bit more up there, and 120 for the knockout. Like I said, exactly moments like that. It's just been, I, I was up really early. I was up late last night. And you know, this is a game that requires, uh, you know, um, to get to that extra like edge level that, you know, it requires a lot. It takes uh, a lot of thinking, more than what um, people from the outside, outside looking in would think. I'm in a good place because it's gonna take him a little bit, at least he'll have to attach another colorless energy. Um, 30, 60, 90, 120. Of course, exactly what I thought was gonna happen exactly what I thought was gonna happen but if he does attack for this I'm gonna just I'm gonna keep slowly inching, inching away at his guys I'm gonna probably go for actually I would hate to use my GX attack on hopefully I can just get a double colorless energy next turn this will take care of this because he's gonna try to retreat out and uh, now he's gonna attack with I think uh, Travelanche because interesting I see so as I discard this is a very brilliant deck. As I discard my item cards, then he also has Garbage Lord to work with, and he starts getting stronger. And 20 adds up 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. I think it's just for item cards, though. He's, he's going for someone else right now, I think. I do have Resistance, thankfully, working with... It just depends everything right now what I want to do. Tough, tough decision. I could shuffle back in there, but I this is gonna be this is gonna be weird because it would take him a little bit longer to set up still and I wanna get I wanna get rid of that garbage door. Yep. That's exactly why I went for this last turn. I can't believe I'm gonna use my GX attack. Oh, I'm a little crazy to do this, but I'm gonna, it'll take him at least one more turn. None of his guys, his other guys, I can't knock out. So um, I need my abilities. So I can't believe I'm gonna use my Dangerous Rogue GX attack on just a 100 Pokemon. But uh, give or take, I mean, the only other way he could evolve things quickly would be Wally. I do have to think about that. He could not get knocked out. I didn't think about that till right this second, but he's coming back in, um, but he would need a double colorless or something. This is a cool deck. I like, like I said, I love playing against, I love playing against new decks. I love playing against non-meta decks. I really want to make, um, something kind of cool like this, uh, another non-meta deck, uh, soon after regionals. Um, but I definitely have options right now to keep going forward because I'm glad I went ahead and went in for a second match because he definitely could. He didn't know this, but had he decided, please get basic Pokemon. Oh, 30, 60, 120. He can get 120, 120. Okay, now he can get the knockout. I already know what I'm gonna do with that Mallow. I've got a couple options right now. Ooh, that puzzle time might have just helped me a little bit. Um, I want. I can retreat him out. I want to knock out this one. I want to knock out that Trubbish, and I'm just trying to figure out how I'm going to do that. I'm going to try to just add a little bit more time to the clock right now. Um, I think it involves Mallow. I'm going to retreat 
treat him out, I think I definitely want to go for that. Um, Treat him out. I need. I do need a double colorless energy. That's okay if I can. I was hoping to knock out this as well. That's okay. But I'm gonna go ahead and try to knock out that Trubbish while I have a chance. Rolla, uh, I'd probably go for Lycanroc right now because he's got the weakness. Although, actually, that doesn't really matter if you wanted to go for Lycanroc, that would be who I would target. Um, yeah, still going for that Trubbish. Nice. <laughs> yeah, like I said, it's just one of those things. This was, um, uh, I'm, I'm just so much more relaxed uh, playing here at home right now than I, uh, okay. I'm gonna just have to burn through my deck just a little bit. Uh, nothing really, I can't evolve anything right now, so we're gonna go ahead and get rid of these. If I get my second... That's kind of cool. Actually, I really don't. None of his guys are... I can get my second puzzle of time right now. Ooh, Acerola, that might be... That might be what I go for. Uh, I still would love... I mean, of course, I'd knock him out. Um, but then that doesn't really, like, provide me a good solution to save either of these guys. But that's okay. That's okay. That's one less Pokemon than... I think that's what I'm gonna play. Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna waste this opportunity not to use good old AC. Because uh, I can still get the knockout with Trevenant and Ant this turn. Uh, but this match is not over yet. Oh, I could play. Mm, but then I couldn't evolve. Then I won't have a heavy hitter this turn. No, nah, because odds, odds are Zorwork GX, this one probably will get knocked out next turn. And then hopefully. I'm not in a great position right now, but it could be worse. I have options. I have pull support still. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and see what my prize card is. So at this point, um, probably will get the knockout with this Garbodor. 20, 40. It's per item card, I think, right? Yeah. Each item card plus the 30, so at least 30. I already know I've added more and more to that. Oh, my second puzzle time. I didn't see that I got that one. Yep. Oh, but my second puzzle time. If they had, had they played N, now I have some options. for the knockout, of course. 
that puzzle time. I'm I'm down like a sore thumb right now. What I'm going to do? So I just need to knock out two more Pokemon. I'm gonna go ahead and try to knock out. I can knock out. Gar I can I can totally knock out Garbodor this turn. They haven't played any. Um, yeah, I have options. I just need to take. I just need to take my time right now. Um, I could actually honestly go for. Doesn't really matter too much. And dig through my deck a little bit more. I definitely don't need. I'm just trying to destroy some of those smaller guys right now. I have I have so many cards in my hand right now. Let's go ahead and put. Yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and try to speed things up. I'm gonna go ahead and knock out. Grab two. How many other things do I have here? Guzma's there, so I have one Guzma in my hand right now. Uh, I could grab another Zorua. Well, no, probably Tapu Lele it. I don't. I don't think I need a Tapu Lele it even though. Do I have how many Zorus do I have in there? Well, I know I need that. I'm gonna go for the two special color, uh, double colorless energy. That sounds good. You know what I'm gonna do? Attach this here. Play this Ultra Ball. See if I can find that second Zorua because I actually do. I guess I could have played Bridget actually. Uh, I guess just this special strong energy, strong charge. Just in case if I need to have something ready for next turn, there's always the possibility that something could get knocked out. Um, and we'll go for the knockout. Now, if I were them right now, this is the part where I would expect to see N appear. I would be very surprised if we didn't see N and they attach. Uh, maybe I should have gone for that Garbodor for that one reason. Um, this is exactly when I would expect to see N appear and slow things down a little bit. But we'll see. Drampa! Saving that Drampa. But I, even if that does happen, I'm towards the bottom pile of my deck where I just gotta get, um, you know, I just need one Lele. I, 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 you know, if something does happen, Zork's got at least two turns, that's fine. Uh, two turns before it gets knocked out. Um, I'm just waiting to see what they do. Fun deck, fun deck. I already see their strategy. I don't know if I would have attached that second double colors energy. Yes, yes. Uh, they're just they're just uh, going in for a knockout. Fighting till the end. Cool. I can totally admire that. And I'm gonna go for my last Pokemon. I'm gonna attack that Garbodor right there. Um. Yep, that's what we're gonna do, because I got Guzma in my hand. I'm gonna attach this Double Colors Energy right here. Play Tapu Lele. I don't even need to use Wander Tag, because I already have Guzma in my hand. Bring out Garbodor. Bring Zork out to the field. And attack with Rice Being. I want to be a good sport. Well played. They have a great deck, a super non-meta deck. I love seeing things like this, because, you know, they didn't really primarily play it with a... Um, GX Pokemon. So you know, if you can find the way to use just like basic Pokemon, it took me. It took me. I had to knock out. I didn't knock out a single GX Pokemon this round. Or did I knock out a Lele? I don't remember already. Maybe I did. I'm gonna quit my yapping and finish this up right here. That is a fantastic second match. Uh, both matches were really cool. I would have loved to see where that first match would have gone, but I'm glad I went ahead and jumped into the second one. I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna wrap things up really, really quickly. Uh, I just, you know, I I don't think I'm gonna change anything from this deck. I just really, really like where it is right now. The the one thing, and maybe maybe if anyone would suggest what card they would put in there, the one thing maybe I would change from this deck right now is maybe I would go to two Ace of Rolls and throw in a third Cynthia, or I've thought about throwing in another Float Stone. Um, 
but honestly everything right now I just love where it's at right now uh, I'm gonna put my yapping this has been Pokemon TCG daily don't forget that subscribe button if you're brand new and if you've made it to this point in the video you are absolutely fantastic I can't believe there's people who have actually like been diligently watching the entire videos or skipping through it and they think my deck is impressive or whatever I'm, 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 I'm literally humbled and flattered and thank you for tuning in even if you watch five minutes of this video or ten minutes of this video or the whole thing it's it's just pretty it's pretty awesome to think someone actually thinks this is worth their time out of their day so yeah i'm gonna put my yap in uh more booster packs and everything else is on the way as it has been every day for the past two months and i love all of you uh, i'll see you again soon